Hi guys, so someone asked a question, what do I eat on a given day? So that's what I'm gonna talk about, okay? So I, I will usually get up about 5.30 in the morning um, and I will have coffee, a very small cup of coffee. It's organic and I put uh, cream in there, whole cream, and it's grass-fed organic. Half a teaspoon of xylitol. So I will drink that and then I'll have about four of my nutritional yeast tablets. Okay, I, I just feel good when I, when I take this. I get up early, I study nutrition, um, and during that time I might have a Ticino, which is a uh, non-decaffeinated alternative coffee type uh, drink, uh, or some more tea. So my first meal is at 1.30, and of course I love eggs. They're pasture-raised organic eggs. I put sea salt and pepper, and they're fried in butter. In addition, I'll do six uh, slices of bacon or three sausages or two grass-fed hot dogs, okay, with the eggs. So your bacon is not your typical uh, bacon. It's from the farmer's market uh, or I'll get it from U.S. Wellness Meats online, okay? And the same thing with the sausage, same thing with the hot dogs, okay? Now, I'll do four ounces of cheese and sometimes I'll throw some olives in there, but I'm a little spoiled with cheese, okay? So this is the type of cheese that I like and this cheese is produced from sheep, on a mountaintop in France, okay? And another cheese that I like would be the Switzerland cheese, raw milk cave aged, okay? And I'll probably have like this much, okay, in my little uh, breakfast. So if I have an avocado, I will also add that in there. And that's pretty much my meal. And then right after the meal, I may consume about four tablespoons of almond butter with celery or pecans. Okay, so sometimes I use the walnuts with the ice cream, but that's gonna be more for dinner, not at 1.30. So I will add some, my electrolyte powder, wheatgrass juice powder in a mason jar, shake it up and drink that down. It seems to give me some good energy through the afternoon. Now, about 5.30 is when I'll eat dinner. Okay, I'll have a huge salad. I'm talking like about 10 cups, okay, all at once. And I don't do spinach, I do other types of lettuce, leaves and cabbage, cut bell pepper, I'll stick sometimes an avocado on there, maybe some other vegetables, sometimes pork rinds and seeds, roasted seeds uh, that are salty with sea salt, okay? So then I'll have my grass-fed beef or pork sausage, which is from the farmer's market again, uh, wild-caught salmon as my protein. So the hard part is finding dressing that I can eat that doesn't have the soy oil or sugar. So here's an example of one that has uh, buttermilk, sunflower oil, sea salt, onion, garlic, and zero sugars. So I'll use that. Here's another one with just olive oil and balsamic vinegar, which is great. But again, it's so hard to find uh, dressing without soy. Balsamic with extra virgin olive oil. This is a good one, no sugar. And this is the one I found recently at Whole Foods that has extra virgin olive oil. Okay, no sugar. So I like that. And sometimes for dinner, I'll have the summer sausage, probably half of this with cheese. And I, you can get this from the U.S. Wellness Meats. This is amazing. It's grass-fed, grass-finished, and no uh, nitrates, no sugar. Then about 10, 15, I'll take a sleep aid, okay? So within 15 minutes, I'm out. So I'll sleep for seven hours and start this cycle over again. Okay, so there you have it. That's an example of what I eat on a given day. Hey, you know what? I just want to say something. Only 30% of the people that are watching this video actually make it this far. And you did. So I really appreciate you. Thank you so much.